Hey everybody, it's Leon of Body Mind 360, and in today's video, we're going to go over the Beach Body On Demand 10 Rounds Week 2 Lower Body Lift Workout in 5 minutes or less with modifications for beginners. Now, let's go ahead and get started. All right, after the warm-ups, the first exercise is going to be done. I'm going to be the deadlifts. They're pretty much borderline straight leg deadlifts here, which is a slight uh, bend in the knees. Now, for this, uh, if you don't have traditional free weights, uh, for me, I use this water jug. If you're a beginner, you don't even need this much weight. You could technically do it with much less weight. One of my clients, uh, she used a little paint bucket she had, a little handle. That works for her. It's not about heavy weights. When you're first beginning, you may just get a lot out of just a stretch here. So for the form, you're going to grab it, bend over, abs tight, bring it straight up, abs tight, squeeze your glutes on the way up. Okay, this next exercise is probably the most complex exercise of this workout, and it is not very beginner friendly. So in the video, you'll see the advanced way to do it. I'm going to show you the heavily modified version. So, you're gonna stick one leg forward, nice and slow motion basically. You're gonna bring the back knee down slightly, and then you're gonna rotate just a little bit, bring it up. Step out, get your balance, bring your back knee down, rotate slightly, and come back. The next exercise I'm gonna show are gonna be the front loaded squats. Now, last week when I did these, I showed it with the heavier weight. Um, you could do this with a much lighter weight, just like this, like a water container. Again, I'm going to show you ultra beginner with no water weight, no uh, weight at all. So the only thing I want you to focus on is white stance where you also have a um, feet straight forward, arms up here where you would have the weight, chest out, and stick your butt back. Do your best kind of Kardashian uh, impression, butt back, and you might only be able to go this slow. Notice my knees aren't going forward. Okay, the next exercise are gonna be the hanging side sways or the side lunges. Um, last week, again, uh, on my leg workout, you can check out the full range for this that you can do for proper form. The thing is, that is gonna stay the same. You're still gonna go, go do a wide stance here, but and you're still gonna put your weight back, like you're gonna try and sit over your heel, but the expectations are gonna be small, slower or lower. So uh, basically, just like this is fine, if you're beginning, have a lot of weight to lose, so you're just going to stick it back just a little bit. Might be just like this. All right, next exercise is going to be the sumo squats. And again, for a beginner, we're going to dump the weights on this. You probably won't need it. You're going to feel this a lot, if you've, especially if you've never been really squatting. So sumo squat, again, wide stance. The difference here is you're going to have your feet out as opposed to in. You're going to really feel it quite a bit different. And again, your range is going to be much Lower. A lot of people find this easier when they're beginning as well. This might be all you can do, and that's fine. Okay, next exercise are going to be the one sided uh, stationary lunges. One leg out, arms to the side, just bring the knee down. And again, you may only go about this slow. Again, might be just as slow, bring the back knee down. Okay, the next exercise are called the, the one leg. Uh, banded deadlift. So what's going to happen here is these bands are going to kind of create this elastic effect. It's going to put the opposite leg back and bring it back and forward for balance. Beginner range. Okay, next exercise is going to be the banded single leg heel lift. So what you're going to do here is you're going to take one of your legs, bring them back, Okay, and you're going to squeeze your glutes as you come back. Kicking back, squeeze your glutes. Dead bug, have the weight up in front of me, knees up. You can reach for the sky, bring it down. Go straight up like this, or over the knees, straight up. Final, final core exercise is going to be the one arm oblique crunch. So again, you're going to come up, cross over a little bit, bring it down, 